Hi, we've made some improvements on the student side design and functionality of your application. In this video, we will guide you through the new design. One of the changes you'll notice is a new header across the top of the screen. Here, you will find a course dropdown so you can select and navigate from course to course. You'll also use the new lecture date dropdown to change lectures and access your materials. And an account settings dropdown where you can insert your cell phone number in case you want to text and answers during lecture. If you have any problems, you can email support or access articles from the help menu located in the right corner. We also added new functionality. Notice that you can now ask a question while viewing slides without having to switch to the question view. To see your question and other student questions and answers, click the question tab. You can also navigate through lecture slides by using the left and right arrow keys on your keyboard as long as the notebook is not in use. When you're confused, you can mark a slide as flagged, and when you want to mark a slide important, just click here. If you want the slides to be bigger, just click the expand button like so. To find what you're looking for more quickly, we've added new navigation options. Click browse slides and use your mouse pad to scroll through the slides and even filter slides between confusing, important, and activities. Lastly, we've added a clear print button so you can print your slides and notes for offline use. If you need more help, please contact support at lecturetools.com. Thanks, and we hope you enjoy the changes.